Hello and welcome to Herald TV News Bulletin with me, Shalene. Curly's Beach Shack demolition, which started on Friday early morning, was stopped by Supreme Court Friday morning itself. Curly's questioned the hurry in the demolition. The apex court has forbidden any commercial activity for the time being. The demolition, which carried out on the orders of the North Goa collector, was underway and was ordered after the verdict of the National Green Tribunal said the structure was illegal. Activists had pr approached the NGT over the illegalities carried out by Curleys. A large posse of policemen, the deputy collector, the additional collector of North, Mamladar and the IGP were present. Hardly had a small portion of Curleys been demolished that the Supreme Court issued an order to stop the demolition. After the owners approached the top court to stop the demolition ordered by the National Green Tribunal. Demolition, we have already filed an appeal before the Supreme Court. Yeah, it is pending for a hearing. It will maybe come up at 10.30. So, you have, we, you we have asked, asked for urgent hearing in Supreme Court yes, to stop yes, demolition? Yes, yes. We have asked. That's the reason I have requested uh, the collector who has visited this site. So, I asked her to wait till 10.30. But uh, I have not heard from her anything. What's your good name, sir? sir My if, name is Gajanan Sir, Kordogar. if any collector of this is uh, yesterday order, after yesterday order... See, the, I'll tell you the facts, what had happened. This is hearing was what taken place on 6th before the entity. Okay? Yeah. And fixed for an order. Order was not passed. Okay. So, 7th, it, it, it shows, it was pending on the website. Mm -hmm. okay. Then on 7th, it shows disposed. But we got an order at 1 o'clock yesterday. Yesterday 1 o'clock the order was uploaded. Yesterday night? Okay. No, yesterday 1 o'clock 1 p.m. Afternoon? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Within, within 24 hours they have come to and we came to know that 7 o'clock they are coming today for the demolition. And I have never, never heard about this. If any moves are uh, Supreme Court? Yes, we have we have prepared an appeal. Okay. We have already informed the collector that I have prepared an appeal. Kindly wait till 10.30. Mm -hmm. okay. so they, they and they are still going ahead. I have told you that I have an order that I have uploaded on the website. अभी 24 घंटा भी नहीं हुआ है इधर 7 बजे इधर आए मेरे हमको लेटर मिला कल रात को कि वो 7 बजे इधर आ रहे करके हमको टाइम भी मिला कुछ निकाल के कुछ नहीं अभी तक अभी तक सामान निकल रहे मैंने उसको रिक्वेस्ट भी इस प्रोटेक्शन पर डिमोलिशन ओके सर पूरा डिमोलिशन कर रहे हैं क्या कर Supreme mm -hmm. Gordon stay dila. Mm -hmm. See, I I claimed to be the owner of 40 to 10. Mm -hmm. Okay, with respect to that, then it is stay kela. Hmm. Order. Uh, when is the police ban? Uh, the police ban? Uh, commercial kele. activity gar pa jinam or something. Till the hearing. Hmm. Next hearing can I be given? Next week, sir. Next week, sir. I'll come back to you on that. Okay. Uh, I think in, uh, Friday it is. Tum ke condition kira chil. Tum kya sangle gorda? Kya? Demolition kira karna kaaj mein. First of all, stay or suddenly to me at the Eka get the Chumis one houses. How could number ten to repeat to me? Then a question go back there. Media to me at the Kasanga Baba Kitana Lagamuno Chumis or I don't number than Janamga to me. Then I serve Baba Iki or Rikida Hagamuno. Natural justice. I don't want to comment with teacher Kaya Lopa Janamaga. Okay, it's Kate Gramka's statement right now. If that's to Kasamosa. It's a political degree. Okay, Samosa, and Maka Kobana, the Alka Ulusha. I only am Angela Kipoka legally Kinata Ulopa. Bakicha, Kinata Ulopa, 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 ते मागे रिवील माय रूल आहे ते सध्या आमका स्टे मध्ये जेर आम्ही सध्या गोया किती जण आहे मान ही अशी कारवाई झाली आहे पहिले फोड झाले असे सकाळी थोडे माझ्या प्रमाणे ऍट लीस्ट टू माय नॉलेज माझ्या प्रमाणे तरी ही पहिलेच फोड आहेत असे अंजुना अजून असे किल्ले असे स्ट्रक्चर असले असे अगेन ऑर्डर ही असले आणि कलीस टार्गेट ते तुमका खबर असा तुम्ही काढा मर सोदून आता आता कळ आहे तुमका नशा करता म्हणून तुम्ही सोतपण काढपा जे हे माझे नो इट इज ऑथोरिटी जे ते जर आम्ही आता आणि ती आमका ऑर्डर मिळा 8 तारखेक एका हमें आज विदिन 24 आवर अपील करून मेंशन करून आमचे आयकलेन कोर्टान ती स्टे दिली कितले दिवस स्टे दिले सर टिल नेक्स्ट हियरिंग क्लिंटन डे सुसा प्रसाद पोलजी एंड प्रकाश कडेकर फॉर हेरल टीवी द स्पेशल इन्वेस्टिगेटिंग टीम हैज अरेस्टेड संदीप वजारकर फॉर बीइंग अलेज्ड इन्वॉल्वड इन लैंड ग्रैबिंग ही हैज बीन अक्यूज्ड फॉर फॉर्जिंग डॉक्यूमेंट्स एंड ड्यूपिंग अ कपल टू द ट्यून ऑफ रुपीस 27 लाख Complainant Purushottam Agarwal from Parori registered a complaint against Sandeep Vazarkar with Mapsa Police. He alleged that Vazarkar dishonestly induced him 
to buy landed property at Sangolda Bardis. He further fraudulently carried out he further fraudulently carried out documentary monetary transaction towards the sale and transferring of legal rights in respect of the property through agreement of sale. He also promised to carry out sale of the property and accepted 27 lakh rupees. After this, the accused cheated him, Agarwal alleged. The case was later transferred to SIT crime for investigation. Shweta Kamath for Herald TV Weary over the loud and disturbing music, 10 locals from Pene had protested against noise pollution caused by a resort in January 2015. Little did they know that instead of their issue being resolved, the police would book them for a state Rasta Roko to draw the authorities' attention to the matter. Since then, two of them have died and the eight continue to fight a legal battle at the GMFC court in Mapsa, which keeps being adjourned since then, while the music keeps getting louder. Very over the loud and disturbing music, 10 locals from Pernet had protested against noise pollution caused by a resort in January 2015. Instead of their issue getting resolved, the police would book them for a staged Rasta Roko. Since then, the eight continue to fight a legal battle at the JMFC court in Mamsa, which keeps getting adjourned. In January 2015, residents of Mojim and surrounding areas had submitted a memorandum to the government threatening to take to the streets if the government fails to act on the noise complaints. Despite repeated complaints to the police and authorities, they failed to act. Person, as Sagayat, Ami, uh, judicial magistrate first class, ya nailat, aropi monon, aropi cha pinzran, hajarasa. As per the sunavani, Ami, dur sunavani, Sagayan, hajarasa. Durdevan, police, je sakshida rasa, kiva adhikari rasa, complainant rasa, te pavanat. एक ना दोन कारण लागून ते खतरी बंदोबस्त असा आणि बाकीचे वजली कारण असतात की त्याचे खूप महत्त्वाचे असतात त्याका लागून आमका एडजनमेंट मिळता आणि यो सुनावणे गेले 5 वर्ष आम्ही 7 वर्ष झाले आम्ही फेस करता आता ध्वनी प्रदूषणाचा व वो जो विषय असा तो अजून मेरेंत चालू असा परंतु जे लोक आवाज उठवून करून आवाज उठवून सुतले की आवाज उठवलो आणि लोकांच्या हिता खातिर आणि लोकांच्या लोकांनी मागणी केली की बाबा आमका मदत करा म्हणून तोय वचून आम्ही शांतता कायन लोकशाहीच्या मार्गान आम्ही निदर्शन जर करीत नले आमचेरच गुन्हे नोन झाले आणि मारावेला रिसॉर्ट किंवा जे कोण वाजयता ते मोकाट असा सो अशा प्रकारे आवाज दबोपाचो प्रयत्न अशा प्रकारचे पेडणे पोलीस स्टेशनाच्या वेळेन क्राइम रजिस्टर करून आमचो आवाज दबोपाचो प्रयत्न करू आम्ही या सुनावणे समर्थपणे सामोरे होता आणि आम्ही सिद्ध करतले की आम्ही भीतर निर्दोष असा आमच्यावर खोटो आरोप घातला बगलाट म्हणी आम्ही ते दाखल केला जेणेकरून आम्ही आणि खै खै वचून उभे राहूचे नाही खंयच्या आंदोलना करचे नाही आणि पोलिसांच्या आणि कोर्टाच्यो फेरे मारत राहूचे या लोकांनी म्हणून आज आम्ही सगळेजण हे सगळेजण आपापल्या व्यवसायात आपापल्या आपापल्या जो नोकरी दाखरी करतात किंवा आपले जो किती व्यवसाय असा घरदार असा ते सांभाळून समाजाच्या हिता खातीर पुढे सरलेले अशा लोकांचे क्राईम रजिस्टर केले दोन हजार पंधरा सोळा सालात जे राजकीय नेते असले कारकिर्द ज्यांची हा याचे म्हणजे सुवर्ण काळ त्यांचा चालू असलो त्या लोकांच्या सांगण्या वेळेन आमचे क्राईम रजिस्टर आयज नॉइज पोल्युशन कमी जाऊन क्राईम रजिस्टर केला त्या दहा लोकांच्या अगेन्स्ट दहा जण आम्ही आरोपी असत आणि तातुतले ह्या सात वर्षाच्या प्रवासात दोघ जण एक सिनियर राघोबा शेडगावकर आणि राजेंद्र साटेलकर हे दोघे जण दोघे जणांचे निधन झालं सो आता आम्ही बाकीच्या उरल्यात ते दर दिसात सॉरी दर हिअरिंगाक हजर राहून कोर्टाच्या आदेशाप्रमाणे आम्ही ते आरोपी म्हणून बसतात बघपूल माझी मनी फॉर हेरल टी व्ही The driver for mini pickup Muhammad Mustafa from Kolwale originally from Uttar Pradesh and two women from Karaswada and natives of Karnataka were arrested after they were found to have stolen goods from the Nora's factory in Kundai the stolen copper cable rolls were worth rupees 2 lakh the case was filed by Anuradha Akram Kadam an HR manager of the Nora India she said that between 3rd and 5th September a known culprit had entered into the Nora India culprits entered the company at Kunda and decamped with copper cable rolls police checked the CCTV footage and found one Tata Ace vehicle which they had traced at Karaswada along with a driver and solved the case <laughs> Valpoi Police Training School celebrated Ganesh Chaturthi for 9 days. 
The Lord of Wisdom was finally given a warm send-off after nine days. The immersion was held after taking the Ganesh idol in procession on a carriage. Valpoi Training School celebrated Ganesh Chaturthi for nine days. The Lord of Wisdom was finally given a warm send-off after nine days. Our DSP Manoj Mardolkar recently police training school has joined the law. My name is Pramane, 1960, 12th of September. So, I am a PTSD staff. अरे तेरे मेरे पास तो आज पहले ना जो सार्वजनिक गणपति उत्सव बड़े उम्मीदी नाम तो स्टाफ ऐ जे महत्व में जिकने आमे अंगाल स्टाफ आज जो सगे कंट्रीब्यूशन आस्ता कोई तो तामे आज जो डोनेशन पे शिक्षित ना करना चाहिए वक्त आम जो स्टाफ आज जो इन्वॉल्वमेंट है तो इतने सगे डेकोरेशन ते सगे गणपति वॉलेंटर है तीन का कंधे कंपलसरी ना आनी ये वन आमी डोनेशन जस्ट आप अगर ना गेदा पाए तो तीन का कंपलसन ना आता वॉलेंटर है तब पढ़े इतु सक्के हंड्रेड परसेंट आपका से है मेटा सक्के अगर ना साकारे मेटा अंत्य का तेरा आपका कस्टली तांगा आर्ट्स एंड बे ना बड़ी उम्मीदें ये वन हम जो थोड़े कि वहाँ जो थोड़े मुस्लिम बंदा वहाँ साइड तो सारे एक उठे ना हमने वो सर्द साधना करता है कोणाचे तो आप असलियत ऑब्जेक्शन ही ना आओ रॉक स्टी बेरो एचडीआई पीटीएस कि आमी वड़े उम्मे दिन अने चतुर्दिशी फेस्टिवल माने था अने आमी आता माकत जाले पोस्टी सर साइन आप ट्रेनिंग स्कूल आप उन्हें � अरे ये जब बरेज आता है लेकिन आम का ट्रेनिंग सासु तो लाम चाहिए नहीं मशहूर लेज़ी हैं मागे आधे आइटम जाता फक्त आता आम चाहिए स्टाफ उसे इन्वॉल्वमेंट हाई चेंज अगर लवन ये जो ऐसा आम चाहिए चालू आस्था के सार के वोडे उम्मीद है ना नहीं वार्ड पे ऐसा हो कि आपके वाल गोवा आम चाहिए � सचिन गावस फॉर हेरल्ड टीवी सेस ऑफ फुटबॉल एकेडमी फॉर गैलेंटली टू कम फ्रॉम अ गोल डेफिसिट टू डिफीट चापोरा यू अक्संग बाय टू वन मार्जिन एंड लिफ्ट द गोवा पुलिस कप इन इट्स एटीन्थ एडिशन द टूर्नामेंट वाज ऑर्गेनाइज्ड बाय गोवा पुलिस स्पोर्ट्स सेल एंड वाज प्लेड एट दुले स्टेडियम ऑन थर्� Finally, the unbeaten run for Chapora Yuvak Sang ended with the large North Coast Belt crowd returning home crestfallen. Chapora's goals did start brightly and went into the breather with a goals lead by Sashi Ana and Satelkar. Omkar Shed Kankar and Fahiz Mohamed scored for Sessa Football Academy. In the 25th minute, Chapora's Pratik Dharkalkar sent a through pass to Sashi Ana and Satelkar, but his shot was saved by Sessa's keeper, Ronald Kankar. Shapora's Ruhit Total then sent a curler near the goal which was parried by Sesa keeper Ronald. Taking advantage of the same, Sashiana slotted the ball into the empty net, making the score 1-0. Shapora conceded a goal through their keeper, Soma's mistake, when he failed to collect a firm grounder from substitute Beckham Set. Omkar made no mistake to slot the ball home, off the rebound making it all square 1-1. Energized by the equalizer, the academy boys took 10 more minutes to take the lead. Sessa's Omkar sent a true pass to Fahid's moment, but the rival keeper came off the plank to toward the forward. However, he failed to collect the ball which rolled to the forward, who calmly sent the ball to the empty net, securing a first silverware of the season for his side. Prakash Karikar for Heron TV. Mapsa JMFC court has granted two additional days of police custody to the accused Sudhir Sangwan and Sukhvinder Singh. Sangwan and Singh, the main accused in the murder case of actor and BGP leader Sonali Fogart, were earlier sent to 10-day police custody. A new update in the Sonali Fogart case. On Thursday, the Mapsa JMFC court has granted two days additional days of police custody to the accused. Sudhir Sagwan and Sukhwinder Singh. Earlier, Singh and Sagwan, the main accused in the murder case of the actor and BJP leader Sonali Fogart, was earlier sent to 10 days police custody. The police custody has now been extended by two days. Sonali's brother, Rinku Daka, had filed a complaint against the two accused in Anjuna police station alleging that the duo had murdered his sister and it was not a case of natural death due to heart attack. Now, about till date, are almost about five persons were arrested in the alleged murders case. Investigation to the case has revealed that Fogart was allegedly drugged on the night of her murder. The victim's family has demanded CBI probe in the case. More details will be soon updated. A story by Clinton D'Souza for Herald TV. 
The High Court of Bombay at Goa has invalidated the Goa Football Association amendment made in 2019. Instead, the court upheld the amendment made in 2018, which limited the age of the President and Secretary to 70 years as correct. As a result, Churchill Alimov submitted his resignation as the President of the Goa Football Association, saying he respected the verdict of the High Court. The High Court of Bombay at Goa invalidated GFA amendment extending the term of the President beyond 70 years made in 2019. Instead, the High Court upheld the previous amendment of 2018, which said that GFA President had to demit office on attaining 70 years. The amendment also said the President could not be in office for more than three terms. As a result of this judgment, Churchill Alemao ceased to be the President of the Goa Football Association with immediate effect as he attained the age of 70 in 2019. Churchill Alemao submitted his resignation as the President of GFA saying he respected the verdict of the High Court. The High Court observed that any decision taken during the course of Churchill Alemao's tenure shall not be called into question. The case against the amendment of 2019 was filed by Salset Football Club. Uh, the president of the Goa Football Association, Mr. Churchill Alemon, resigned today from the post of uh, presidentship of the association. In a letter, he said, I respect the verdict of the Honorable High Court, which was given today in the afternoon, and in view of the same, he tenders his resignation as the president of Goa Football Association. The verdict was given in the afternoon and uh, later on, he sent the letter of resignation to uh, the association uh, headquarters in Panjim. The uh, verdict was given basically due to the national Sports Development Code 2011 and uh, <clears throat> the code talks about 70 years being the age bar. You cannot remain in the office once you complete 2011 <clears throat> and he completed that in the year 2019 having been elected in 2018 he was at that time 69 and uh, the moment uh, he touched uh, 70 years in 2019, uh, <clears throat> the court says you cannot remain any longer in the office. This is applicable uh, now all over India and uh, All India Football Federation has already implemented it and uh, this is uh, in uh, uh, continuation of the National Sports Court which is in force already. Bureau Report, Herald TV. Goa's much-delayed coastal zone management plan 2011 has been finally notified by the Union Ministry for Environment, Forest and Climate Change on Tuesday. Reacting strongly to this development, activists have called on the government to show people structures and declare that the rivers, kazans and coastline belong to the people. They fear that with the new CZMP, our resources will be handed over to corporations. Activists have demanded to incorporate people's structures in CZMP and denotify port limits. They fear that with the new CZMP, our resources will be handed over to corporations. They also want people not to be complacent since port limits are not denotified. Activists also want people not to be complacent since port limits are not shown in the CZMP. But at the same time, port limits are not denotified, they pointed out. They called on the government to incorporate the people's plan into the CZMB. This paper is news that the central government has approved the CZMB plan. This is the CZMB plan that is under the plan of CRZ. The government has approved the CZMB plan. 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 तीन वर्ष फाटी जेना ये प्लैन सरकार पैली के लोकान पे कि लोक कहीं हजेर दाखोक ना अधिकार घर नुस्ते मारपे कहीं दाखोक ना आनी हा प्लैन एनवायरमेंट से कहीं दाखोक ना लोग रस्त्यार देंवले आनी लोकानी हजेर खूब एजुटेशन के लिए लास्ट 
सरकार जेना कहीं आयकना गांवत योपा तैयार ना सत्य कितने पोपा तैयार ना ये पड़ोन लोक सगले गाँव के लोक स्वता खूब त्रास का करेक्ट सी जेड एम पी प्लैन प्रिपेर कर सरकार धड़े पुण हा प्लैन सरकार मास्त सुधा लक्ष घूक ना आनी जे वे कॉर्पोरेशन जाए भाषे प्लैन कर मुखार वरत ग सरकार आता ते संगत कि पोर्ट लिमिट्स हजेर दाखोक ना पुण खरे मैं ये जे पोर्ट लिमिट्स आसा ते हा सरकार डी नोटिफाय करूँ जाए जैर गांव सामाटले क्या न्यो खाजना दरिया देख हम गांवकार जता गांव की जता पुण सरकार मेजर पोर्ट्स ऑथॉरिटी एक्ट यूज करून आनी नैशनल वॉटरवेज एक्ट वापरून ये सगले आपसे जे मुखा पिड़िया गिरेस्काय आसा ती चोरूँ सोता आनी कॉर्पोरेशन दिवक सोता सो लोक हजेर एजुटेशन खूब के प्लैन आज ही खरी आसा कि सरकार नुस्तेकार कहीं दाखोक ना फिशिंग राइट्स दाखोक ना फिशिंग एरिया दाखोक ना नुस्ते खे पिकता कि कहीं दाखोक ना हम लोक अधिकार दाखोक ना आप घर स्ट्रक्चर ही दाखोक ना हाका लगन सगले लोक ये एजुटेशन मुखार वो पड़े आी जेड एम पी लोक जाए भाषे हमें मुखा पिड़िया सामापा खीर सारे कर पड़े आदित्य बिद्रे फॉर टीवी A motorcycle taxi operator was seriously injured when a tree fell on him. The incident occurred on Thursday early morning wherein a gulmohar tree uprooted and fell on the moving vehicles including bus and a motorcycle while the roadside electric pole fell on a moving lorry. This also resulted in a huge traffic jam at Borim. Here's more. Now on Thursday morning a pilot a motorcycle pilot was seriously injured in a tree felling incident. This also resulted in a huge traffic jam at Borim. The incident occurred on Thursday early morning wherein a gulmohar tree uprooted and fell on the moving vehicles including a bus and a motorcycle while the roadside electric pole fell on a moving lorry. Now this incident took place at around 7:15 in the morning which resulted in one motorcycle pilot being seriously injured. The gulmohar tree at top Kolabori was uprooted and fallen on his moving vehicle as well as passenger bus. Due to this the tree collapse incident and also resulted in one electric pole falling on a moving lorry following to this there was a huge traffic jam along queues of vehicles were witnessed at the Borim highway I go eta sakale anga barobar satha sumar anga e gulmaharachi jada ang padle ani khub jana damage jale asa bar ye jale ki bus ko nal den kaan jauna fakt bai gulu dalo tek mas damage jale tek hospital aila asa pai naste fracture asa लंडन इतने सैडी हाथ उपकारता कुमेल कुमे क्लियर कर इतने लोक त्रास जाना पोल पड़ा हंगा बर बर लोक शॉप बीन यूज कितने टॉपकोला फैक्ट्री भी हाँ कॉर्नर आई खूब आड़ा हिंदी मारू जाए व्यवस्थित ना दिए संगा मारा मारता ब्यूरो रिपोर्ट फॉर हेराल टीवी That's all we have in today's news bulletin. Thanks for watching Herald TV News. For more news alerts, please follow us on Oheraldo on Facebook and Twitter. Take care and goodbye.